Hello, my name is Jan Aukus and uh, please bear with me because it's the first video log that I'm actually making, the first vlog. But uh, this is an, um, meant to be as an introduction to the 11 minutes uh, demo clip that I have attached to this one. It's a uh, video compilation of a two hour movie that I made, a two hour video that I made from our trip to Dubai last September 2019. Now, actually, I'm a still photographer. I am a professional photographer for the local media or for the city that I'm living or for companies that hire me in for the projects. However, video is something that I like, uh, but I try to make video with my system camera. I am a fanatic Fujifilm fan, the X-Series fan. I use the X-T3 and the X-H1. Uh, to make my still photography and I use the Fujifilm also to experiment a little bit with video. However, if you enter a room with a camera like this, you need something like a stabilization system, like a gimbal, or you need like a tripod. You're always traveling around with extra equipment, uh, maybe sometimes even lights to have extra light into the room. Um, it's very intimidating to people when you walk in the room and you have all that stuff with you, like a gimbal and all this kind of stuff. Also on vacation or on trips or whatever, I don't like to carry around all this kind of stuff. I'm a light traveler, I would like to have one small bag and that's it and everything in it. Now when it comes to video, then some, I found out beginning of 2019 in February, I found out about a new kind of a camera or a new kind of system that's called the DJI Osmo Pocket. It is wonderful. It is very small. It's only 12 centimeters high and it is 116 grams. It can fit into any kind of place into your bag or even in you can record from like in your pockets of your clothing or whatever. Uh, it's very small. It has everything in it. The picture quality is outstanding. I can say it is of course not as you know if you have more difficult situations then you need something else like too dark or too light. You get too much noise in your, in your video. But for general purposes on trips or whatever it is an absolute wonderful device. It is almost perfect. Uh, it has a 3-axis gimbal on top and DJI has been known for their gimbals and for their uh, drones. So they know what they're doing when it comes to this. So they developed this little device, uh, the DJI Osmo Pocket. Now, first of all, I'm not associated with any kind of company or any kind of uh, name of whatever. I don't get any benefits. I don't get any freebies. Uh, I just want to do an introduction to a small demo clip that's 11 minutes long. So people, so especially my friends and people who are interested know uh, what I'm talking about. Those of you who are familiar with this and uh, with the DJI Pocket, um, there is no actually, there is, it is not a full review. There is no technical details, just a small little few items that I'm pointing out so people know what I'm talking about. Now the DJI Osmo Pocket is a very simple device. It has basically two buttons and the camera and that's it. So you turn it on, it initializes and the camera is ready to go. It takes a few seconds and you can start filming. Now if I tilt the camera you can see that the lens is actually following uh, the subject and there is several ways to go into the menu to change that. You can make decisions on how the camera will follow the object or how it will record it. You can tell it to follow with you so it turns very smoothly with you or you can actually say it will stay with the subject or whatever. So that's all possible. Now um, in order to make it a little more uh, usable uh, in terms of okay, this is the smallest way you can use it but in terms of make it a little more usable uh, you can see here the connecting points and actually at this space there is a uh, room for an extension uh, plug in which you can actually attach like a mobile phone. So the mobile phone sits right here and it is attached to the device through this connection over here. So you can follow it on the mo on your mobile phone, the images that you're filming. Because the small screen 
screen is small, it's, uh, it does the job, but it's too small to look into the details and you want to be finicky about focusing and all this stuff, then you need to attach a mobile phone to it. Now, another device which I'm actually very happy about is a controller wheel. This controller wheel looks like this and if I turn it around you will see there is connecting points on the other side. This means you can actually slide it on to this, uh, to this video thing, to this Osmo Pocket. It sits like this and it is now able to follow uh, with the Okay, see if I use this, I can point it up and down or sideways and it will actually, I can show you it like this. Here it is, it goes up and down, focuses on me, I can go left and right, etc, etc. Now, uh, without going into further details, I will center it again. Okay, and I will turn it off. There's another device that I would like to point out to you. So that I'm using, that I'm also happy about, and that's a extension rod. And the extension rod is a little bit bigger, but it helps you in certain kinds of situations. And the beautiful thing about the extension rod, let me open it up is here you see again the um, connector the connectors the connecting points you can slide it onto the so and then close it on this side oops it's a little bit unhandy in front of the camera so now it's connected I can point it out, straight it up, and it's like an extension rod. It's not, you know, there are many extension rods on the market that are very cheap and effective, but this one is connecting to it. And when I open it up like this, you can see there are, um, are buttons there which I can control the device. There's a joystick. Now the joystick, can, you can move the camera in every direction you like. And then extra buttons for menu items that you can uh, select. Um, on the stick, so this is this is very helpful. Of course, you can um, always use like a mobile phone to uh, clip into this uh, holder, and the mobile phone can be connected to the DJI via USB-C, or you can actually use the um, Wi-Fi adapter. And the Wi-Fi Bluetooth adapter attaches like that to the mobile phone, to the DJI. And now you can actually communicate via Wi-Fi or Bluetooth and control your um, camera like that. I like this very much. Now, of course, the, the camera can do still photography and can do video. And it can do the video in uh, maximum 4K, 60 frames per second. Uh, and uh, the, the still images, I forgot what the resolution is, but it is uh, about 4000 whatever. Uh, so that's also not bad. But still pictures, I still use an, in my system camera, the Fujifilm. And in addition to the Fujifilm, I like to use this as a video device and the most beautiful part of this is that it is very stealth it is very nobody needs to know that you are filming and uh, that makes it the film the, the the clips very nice much nicer because people don't know that you're actually filming them and they are not intimidated by it so see how small i can turn it off and on walk with it forwards backwards and do selfies with it uh, you know to take a video of myself explaining things and this is what the wonderful part of this item is now without further ado enough of my babbling around i would like to uh, point you you get to the video clip that's behind this and a small demo 11 minutes to show you different uh, clips that i made all of this is made with the dji Osmo Pocket and um, the full video that I have, the two hour, is a, a combination of still images, music and video and that is the most wonderful thing you can do uh, when you're creative like doing something on, on, on the video. When you watch the demo uh, please pay attention to the video quality but also pay attention to the uh, stabilized image.
There is a scene there where I'm sitting in the minivan and we're driving uh, over a road with a lot of like uh, large bumps, speed bumps in there. Now you can uh, see then how the system stabilizes it very nicely. The horizon is straight and the, the, and the vehicle is moving back and forth but when you look through the front window with the Osmo Pocket and you film that it stays extremely stable so that's what I really like about this system after that when it's finished I usually um, burn it onto a blu-ray disc I usually do it in ultra HD uh, which is almost like 4k but that is better for the uh, screen size and uh, Ultra HD I put it on blu-ray disc and if you watch it on a big screen it's like better like a, a movie theater it's wonderful okay thank you very much for your attention watch the video if you have any comments or questions please leave it uh, contact me and I will definitely answer your questions so thank you and bye bye Dames en heren, hartelijk welkom in Dubai. De lokale tijd is 8 uur en 10 minuten en de temperatuur is 34 graden zo.
Shortly, the world dormitory in uh, Sharjah and Dubai. 